Now on your home for minor league baseball, MLB The Show has coverage from the AAA Pacific Coast League. Ought to be a good one here between the El Paso Chihuahuas and the Tacoma Rainiers. Coming to the plate now, Bravik Valera. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Now the 2 1 pitch. Oh, right back to him on the mound. And he'll flip on to first to record the out. So striding forward now, CJ Abrams, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 1 2. And a foul pop behind the plate. Hudson has a play, makes the play, and there are two gone now. Striding in, Taylor Trammell. And he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. A 1 1. Misses for the second ball. Bases are empty here with two men out. Ball three. And this is drifting foul back into the stands. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Now at the plate, Edgar De La Cruz. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Count is one and two now. Now here's the pitch. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. And a pitch down that swung on and sent to second base. And he will whip this one over to first in time for the out. Stepping in, Brayton Bishop. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Fastball in there, three and two. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Standing in, Dom Thompson Williams. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. One one. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. Two and two now with two gone here in the home half of the first. Fouled away. And he fouls this one off. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Oh, got him looking at the two seamer, and that'll end it. New inning set to get underway and set to go as the third baseman, Jason Vossler. Ready to deliver the one and two. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. Set to get his evening at the plate started, Webster Rivas, batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season. Grounded to third, reined in. Throw in time at first for out number two. At the plate, Michael Geddes. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Two out, nobody on. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Bishop is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Last half of the second set to go, and next to bat will be the outfielder, Jack Larson. The 2-1 home is swung on and missed for strike number two. Hops this one up. 
Valera ranging into shallow right. He can't get there as it falls in. Batting fifth, the designated hitter, Allen Henson. Into the box now, Allen Henson. He's running. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And the throw will come in quickly from center, so despite the hit and run, they won't get the extra Thanks, base here. The third base Jake Standing in now, Jake Shiner. This is flared out towards second. Throw to first is in time for the first down. Standing in now with runners in scoring position, Dylan Moore. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. A 1-1 home. Hit on the ground out to short. Fielded cleanly. Only play is going to be at first, so that'll go as an RBI that brings home the opening marker of the ball game. Coming to the plate now, Joe Hudson. Opportunity for him here to pick up that runner from second with two away. Ready with the 1-1. One -one. Henson stands at second with two gone. Slider, and this is hit on the ground out to short. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Ready now, Ty France. 7 8 9, bottom of the order set to go here in the third. Grounded to first. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. Stepping in, Jorge Ona. He's hitting in the 270s on the Ona. season coming into this one. In for a strike, and he jumps ahead one and two now. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Now here's the pitch. Popped him up. Walton over to his left. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Into the box now. Brad Zunica. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Two balls and a strike. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But, hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. Hit out towards second. Scooped up. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. of the third now and coming forward now is the shortstop Donnie Walton ready to deal here's the 1-1 one -one. pitch boy. taken several inches below the zone in fact late on that one as it's foul off to the left side the 2-2 swung on and missed really fooled him that time for the first down now batting. Into the box, the Edgar De La Cruz. Edgar. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Slider, and that's hit on the ground towards second. Right to him. And there are two away now. Digging in for his second at bat, Braden Bishop. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, but it was a good change up, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. All set for the start of the fourth, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Bravik Valera. The 2-1. Sent on the ground out to second. He's got it. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Digging in, C.J. Abrams, 0 for 1 after a pop-out in foul territory his first time through. 
Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop-up foul. This one's outside. Quite a bit off the plate that time. You know, when you haven't gotten a guy on base yet in the entire game, a three-ball count kind of feels like a little mini rally. Let's see if he can get on. Full count, three and two. And he looks at ball yep. four now. So he's aboard, and you always have to worry about the threat of the steal when he's now on base. The left fielder, Taylor Trammell. Throw over to first, and he'll dive back in. One one runners going there's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field but he will haul this in on the run as he had to go back to the warning track to do it and there are two away now next back. will be the cleanup Third hitter three. Jason Vossler he was a strikeout victim Vossler. in his first try yeah and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball you could tell he was late on that one and we'll oh, see guy. if he tries to cheat to something this AB two and one to count. And there he goes towards second. In there. Now the throw is going to be far too late. That's a stolen base. Two and two. Here it is. Now on three and two as a pitcher, you've got to go with the pitch that you feel most comfortable throwing with. Line down the left field line. But this is foul near the seats. Here's the payoff pitch. This is line to left. Bishop is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Digging in now, Dom Thompson-Williams. First time up, he went down looking. Yeah, Matty, and he was locked up by a good fastball for strike three last time. I'm interested to see if they attack him the same way. Come at him with hard velo late or snap something off in the dirt to see if he'll fish. Line to shortstop, and there's one away. Stepping into the box, Jack Larson. He reached on a single in his first try. Bases are empty, one man out. And that's on the outside corner, one and two. It's been more than two innings since this guy's allowed anyone to reach base. He looks pretty unbeatable on the bump right now. Fielded cleanly. And there's out number two. Now Digging that, in the, the switch hitter, hitter, Alan Henson. One for one after a single this first time up. Lays off the slider that time. Two and one. Swing and a miss. Strike two. That front door slider is a devastating pitch. By the time you realize it's in the zone, it's too late. And you can't even put a good swing on it. And the inning is going to continue here as he reaches on an infield single. Now that the third base and now Jake Shiner shin high that's taken for a ball and there's a fastball well off the plate inside team's been struggling on offense let your D work for you right here pound the zone and this pitch misses for ball four so that's going to move a runner into scoring position now with two away now batting Dylan Moore two men on two away here in the fourth here's the one two hit out towards second scooped up the throw pulls the first baseman off the bag now everybody's going to be safe Bases full now following the error. And next to hit is the catcher, Joe Hudson. Swing and he pops him up. And this should get him out of it. Zunica is there as he makes the catch. And they'll tightrope out of danger as he strands the bases loaded. ready to go in the top of the fifth and now it'll be the catcher Webster Rivas we're moving through the middle of this ball game right now they want to get things going 
How about trying to get some base runners on or at least get a base hit? They don't have any hits going into this part of the game. Now back the center fielder. At the plate now, Michael yeah. Geddes. Oh, down. down low, two balls and a strike. Skied into straightaway right. Larson will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Next will be the designated hitter, Ty France. Runners on first with one down. Down the third baseline, but a foul ball. One and two the count now. A great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one, and he's down on strikes for the second out. Now battle. Right Stepping up to Jorge. the plate, Jorge Ona. He flew out in his last at bat. Outside, two and one. Nearly got the inside, but ruled the ball. Brad Zunica would be next if they can keep this inning alive. And it's up to a 3 2 full count now. 3 2, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. Reined in. So they do get their first hit, but their first run will have to wait as the inning is over. Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and stepping up as the shortstop, Donnie Walton. The 1 1. Left side, but well fouled. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Now, now back, back to the top of the lineup, man. stepping in, Edgar, Edgar De La Cruz. De La Cruz. <laughs> one and two now as that one's fouled mm -hmm. off. Now the pitch. This one's flared off to the right side into the slide and he comes up with a great catch for the second out. So digging in now Braden Bishop he's hitless in his two at bats so far. Looking to send him packing again. Swing and he pops him up looks to be playable in foul ground and he'll lunge out of the crouch to put this one away. Good reactions there and the inning is over. Stepping into the box, Brad Zunica comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Hit hard, but this is a foul ball. The 1 2. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will land untouched. The 1 2. Nope. That's popped up. Shiner into shallow left. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. Ready for another chance? Bravik Valera. He was a ground out victim last time up. And this one's up around the eyes, two and one. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. And a fastball misses there, ball four. In now, C.J. Abrams. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Abrams. Here's a look over to first, and he'll get dirty, but he's back in safely. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. We could see the runner in motion here on a 3-2 count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing. And he'll lay out to make a spectacular catch. Wow. Now to the plate, Taylor Trammell. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Trammell. 
And he lays off for a ball, two and one. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Well, this has been a long inning already, and I know he doesn't want it to get any longer. I expect a challenge pitch right here. And a good at-bat that time as he lays off for ball four. And as a result, that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away. The 2-2. Two -two. Hard hit ball to second. Right to him. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. With the plate, Dom Thompson Williams. A strikeout and a lineout for him so far. And he popped him up. Abrams onto the grass. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first the right down. Number 13. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Jack Larson. He's working on a one for two game so far. High in the air into shallow left center. And he will make the play. Two away now. Alan now Hansen the, the next to bat. Alan. Bases are empty here with two men out. Tried to bury one down and away, but it's a full count now. Three and two. This is line to left. Well, this is going to hang up there just long enough to be taken in on the run in shallow left, and that ends the inning. Cody Anderson is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 16, Cody. Now at the plate, Webster Rivas will start the seventh in what's been a fast-moving pitcher's duel to date. The 1-1 home. There's a fastball that misses. Sent on the ground out to second. Fielded cleanly. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. Now back. So coming to the plate, Michael Geddes. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. High and deep down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. He's going to be thinking about that pitch all night if he doesn't have a big game right here. Pulled his front shoulder and everything went with it. Two balls and two strikes now. The 2-2. Two -two. Line toward right center. And that's into the outfield for a one-out base hit. Now that designated hitter. Ty. Stepping in now, Ty France. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. The three and one pitch. Finds the zone to fill the count, three and two. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side and that'll get down for a base hit and that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. So now to the plate Jorge Ona change up gets him out in front for strike two. Now a swing and he pops him up and I believe yes the umpire signaling for the infield fly rule and that's the second out. So striding in, Brad Zunica, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Here's the 1-1. And it's 1-2. and two. You chase a pitch that bad outside the zone, you got to find a way to regroup. Adjust the batting gloves. Only look over the hard row 17 inches. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Ready with the 1-2. Oh, Big spot. Two out, possible tying and go ahead runs on base. Frozen on strike three for the final out of the inning. 
with the traditional seven turning Into the box now, Jake Shiner. It was a walk in his last trip. Ball two. So a full count now. From 0-2 to 3-2, what a great at-bat to start this inning off. Hey, this could be a productive inning. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Another full count pitch home. And that misses ball four. It's a leadoff walk to start the home seventh. Jake Cronenworth takes the ball here as he'll enter with a runner at first and nobody out. Dylan Moore will be the first to stand in against the new pitcher as he'll do so with a runner at first and nobody out. Had nibbled the corner there, but missed two and one. When you've got a guy that throws a good two-seam fastball, you have to be ready for him to try to run it inside and jam you. Good job to lay off that one, but I wouldn't be surprised if we see it again. The three and one pitch. Slapped hard the opposite way. Ona is there to put it away for route number one. Stepping up now, now Joe him. Hudson. No Number hits in two seven. trips to the plate for him in the ball game. Now the one and one pitch is taken for ball two. Cronenworth has tossed over 30 innings so far this season, and through those innings, he's posted a whip a little under 1.5. Certainly something he'd like to improve on. The count now at two and two. Q shot here out towards short. In there, a base hit. Now that is just up. Got it. To the plate now, Donnie Walton. Now a ball sliced out of play down the left field line. Here now the 2 2. Pulled toward right center field. And this will get over the wall, in fact, so just the one run will be allowed to score. Now that the second baseman, Edgar. At the plate, Edgar De La Cruz. And this is taken for a called third strike. So they go right at him with the base open, and it pays now off. And now there are two gone in the inning. Ready with the 2-1. Here's a swing and a ball hit into the air to left center and shallow. Abrams will put this one away and the side is retired. Yay, Matt McGill has been You're summoned right, from please. the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Right Settling in now, Bravik Valera. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. Full count now, three and two. Now a ball hits sharply toward third, and that finds the outfield grass for a base hit. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. The bat, number nine, football. Into the box now, C.J. Abrams. Down low, two balls and a strike. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Taylor Trammell, who represents the possible go-ahead run here, waits in the on-deck circle. Three and two now. Now the payoff pitch home. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. At the plate, Taylor Trammell. Oh, for two for him to this point. Runner at second here with one man out. And that misses ball four. So with one out, that'll at least set up the double play possibility here that could get them out of the inning. Jason Bosworth. The 2-2. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Digging in to try it again. Now, Webster Rivas in a big at bat in this one. Two on, two away here in the eighth. 
The one two he is swung on and missed. He got him. Jerry Keel is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 44. Jerry. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And at the plate will be the speedy outfielder, Dom Thompson Williams. Hit the target, but this is low, two and one. Lays off the change up, and he's ahead in the count now, three and one. Well, this is the matchup they wanted bringing in the reliever, but falling behind 2-0 doesn't exactly help the situation very much. Hit on the ground out to short. He's got it. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. Riding in once again, Jack Larson. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Here now the 2-2. And there's a base hit on the line. Now batter, the designated hitter. Now a throw now over to first, just keeping him close. In now, Allen Henson. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Scooped up. There's one. On to first, and he really paid the price at second base, but it's a double play, and the inning is over. Brendan Brennan comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. All set to start the ninth in this one, and next it'll be the outfielder, Michael Geddes. Looking for base runners here as they're down two playing on the road. Not an easy thing to do, trying to score runs or bunch hits together off of a closer. One ball and two strikes to count. Lays off to one two changeup, and he's worked it back to two and two. This is skied into short left center. Center fielder giving chase. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Ty France. Last time through was a base hit. Yeah, guys, everyone knows he's been slumping. Dan, you can certainly attest to this, only amassing a solid one hit in your entire career. But pressure's off now. Maybe he gets hot. Tried to crush that ball, and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. One out, nobody on. And it's fouled away. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Locks him up for strike three. Stepping in and ready for another now, shot, Jorge Ona. And he Jorge needs to make something happen. Ona. They're down to their final out here in the ninth. Set. Here's the 3 1. And this is swung on and missed. So now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. Fouled off. One strike from a shutout. Here it comes. And this ball swung on and hit to center field. And this should do it. He makes the catch. And they have taken the opener here at home as this ball game is over. Well, as a former pitcher, you know I love these low-scoring games as opposed to those slugfests. This was like a throwback game when home runs weren't so common and pitching was really dominant. No complaints here. This evening's game finishes 2-0 the final score. The Tacoma Rainiers took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Justice Sheffield wins his third of the season, permitting only one hit in six complete innings. Cal Quantrill pitched well, allowing only two earned, but ends up taking the loss. Brendan Brennan hammers down the save his ninth of the year.
So that just about does it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way on over to theshownation.com. For the visitors, no run, four hit, one error, they left eight runners on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 25 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this evening. We remind you to please drive home safely.